seen this story making the rounds on our social media. A fisherman caught an alligator on Norris Lake in Union County. Probably going for a smallmouth, maybe a stripe, you know, the, the rockfish, those big old fish, but they caught a gator instead. TWRA says, yep. It actually happened. Well, this happened in Dotson Creek area, also known as Butcher Hollow on Norris Lake. Happened around 5 o'clock yesterday. Our Lexi Lepoff is now with the gator and has more on how it got here. Whenever they called me and said that Norris Lake had turned into Louisiana, I, I didn't know where that was going. And he said, hey, you won't believe me, but I've got an alligator for you. When Corbin Cox with Little Ponderosa Zoo and Rescue got the call from TWRA that an alligator was found in Norris Lake, he said he couldn't believe it. And I'm like, oh, surely it's a caiman. You know, we've had this before. Surely it's going to be a caiman, but no, he's a real deal. Stretching nearly four feet long, TWRA says an angler caught the gator while fishing. The agency thinks someone brought the animal to the state illegally. This one did not get there on its own. Someone brought it from another state and has turned it loose in to Norris Lake. We can uh, verify that. TWRA says East Tennessee is not a good habitat for gators. It's too cold in the winter. I would say that it's very unlikely that there are any more out there, but you know, obviously anything's possible as you can see uh, what happened yesterday. The crew at Little Ponderosa is caring for the gator until they can find it a more suitable home. Cox says the gator felt like an ice cube when he first touched it. Right now we're trying to get him warmed up and that actually takes a while when they've been that cold for that long. So we're trying to warm him up, get him going good. Maybe we're hoping to be able to feed him some chicken later on this evening, and get his belly full. And then we're just hoping to keep him going until we can move him on to the place that can really do a good job for him. In Anderson County, Lexi Lepoff, WVLT News. The only way you'll see another gator in our lakes or rivers here in East Tennessee if it got too big for somebody's bathtub and they decided they wanted to throw it out in the water. So if you see one, don't approach it. Call TWRA right away.